Do you know what time it is? That's right, it's time for a new video! Thank you for joining me at Ryan Dome. Today we're going to be doing something a really, really cool. I've uh, been putting together a pause menu for the past couple days, and um, I, I want to show it to you guys. So, this video is not going to have a lot of content, uh, except I'm going to fast forward through me creating the pause menu. And then I will, I'm not really going to explain it in all depth, but I will show you the end result. And of course, the links are in the description. Uh, go to my website, you can find the pause menu script, download it, put it on your first person controller. And yeah. One more thing before I cut into the script, as uh, I just re reached 100 subs. You guys have been really rocking the support. I love it, and I really appreciate it. But uh, without further ado, let's get started. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is right click, create JavaScript, and we're gonna name this pause menu. All right, go ahead and open that up in mono develop. And uh, let's begin. I've got all the kinks out of it, it all works great, and uh, I'm going to show you guys what it does. So go ahead and save this, and uh, here I've got my pause menu, my pause menu, script, click on my first person controller, drag the pause menu onto it. Uh, you'll see we have a lot of different options here, uh, but let me quickly go over the script before I run it. Uh, it's, it's a lot to go over, but basically what we're doing is, uh, I'll show you what it does. When you press play, you look around, uh, the flashlight still works, but when you press escape, it brings up this menu. So it's got a ton of different little options, settings, it's got a, an audio setting so you can change the volume. So I could change that, uh, the flashlight sound, so if I go back softer by turn it all the way down it's really soft I don't even know if you can hear that uh, graphics there's good and beautiful uh, for the right now you can add more later but I think this is good so good it uh I mean for our game right now you can't really notice a difference um, but like, okay, look at the grass, right? So see how, like, um, it looks nice over there? And then I have to go to settings, and I decrease it to beautiful or good or simple. Yeah, we'll just go to the fastest. Uh, you can notice the lighting is really bad. Um, it's just, but it would run really quickly. If I go increase it, see how it increases it here? Simple. Continue. Looks a little bit better fantastic so it does it does change it um, but it's really changing the render um, the lighting things like that which is pretty cool all right in the credits uh, you you would have to go into the credits and create a credit menu and uh, add it to your pause menu um, but let me show you like so credits we'll do two and you add textures, so let me just find a uh, texture, something. I'll do a texture of the ghost. So when I pull up spray, press play, credits, you'll see it has a ghost. And you can have that a picture of you. Um, and then you can also go in to your credits and change this to like Ryan Wall. 
and now credits Ryan Wall, uh, which has a little bit more of um, leeway to that. I have to say, I like it. Um, so yeah. Also on the uh, the credits thing, not not the credits, the main menu. Uh, so we have the settings. Continue continues the game. Uh, settings credits and quit to main menu. Uh, that will load whatever your main menu is, which we you do build settings. So my main menu is two. Um, so I would go into my script here, and where it says load menu, where is that down here? Uh, so it says load main menu. Uh, you would change that to load level, and I could change it to, I said two, right? It's two? I believe it was two. Save. Um, so now if I press that, it should load. Yeah, loads back to the main menu. And I can hit play and begin my game again. So that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope you really enjoy this. Implement it into your game. It's a really cool script that I put together for you guys. And um, it's got a lot of potential. Uh, that's about it. Thanks for watching.